Hello everyone, my name is Eric and welcome back to Beat Cop. We're on day 13, Church of the Third Revelation, which we found out a little bit about yesterday. Let's see how you did yesterday. Take a quota met, cars towed, good job, patrol completed, perfect intervention, good call sorting out with that guy. What about the intervention, Kelly, overall? Keep it up, Jack. Keep it up. He's happy with us. That's it for today. Let's move on to the attractions. People. Bad day, boss? Goddamn, McNabb. Ever heard of mints? It's as if the seventh circle of hell just split open in there. In here. Huh. Listen up. The street's crawling with fuck nuts. And for once, I ain't talking about you, Shipansky. Thanks, boss. They call themselves the Church of the Third Revelation. They figure today they'll get their five minutes in the spotlight. Uh-huh. It's some sort of cult and the press is already up my ass about it. Sat satanists? Sa satanists? Nope. They're run by some serious wacko. Get rid of their posters. And chase those punks away. This is part of the bigger propaganda campaign, so... Take care of it, okay? I want my beat as quiet as the IRS commissioner's funeral. So get the show on the road, asshats! Okay, Cortez, what are you staring at? Browser? What? Can I crash on your couch tonight? Quit joking around. Seriously, someone shot my neighbor last night. Sorry about that. Fuck him. Why is the investigation team's keeping me up all night? I still... it's still no. Damn. Why did you decide to become a cop, sir? My father was one. A beautiful family tradition. And you know why he decided to become a cop? Because your grandpa was one? Nah, because he wanted to catch thugs. Is there a point in, to this anecdote? Yeah. I agree. Ah, uh, yeah, Kelly's on it. <laughs> Kelly knows what's going on here. Alright, asswipes, get on the streets. Shipansky, I got a very important question for you guys. What happened? Who took my Cosmo from the shitter? Why do you read Cosmo? I'm rediscovering my wife's femininity. But why is it in the shitter? Because I'm a cock. That's the only place I got time to read. Wow. Well, that was enlightening. Fuck! Why did nobody wake me up? You looked so sweet sleeping. McNabb, do I look like a big bird? Like Big Bird to you? Is that a trick question? Do I look like Big Bird, McNabb? I'd say no, sir. That's right. Cause we ain't on Sesame Street, are we? I love this guy. We ain't, sir. And that miss is from Sesame... And what's missing from Sesame Street? Crime, sir? They're spot on, Kelly. And what's being ravaged by crime? The streets? New York, sir? Oh, well, I was close. So what the fuck are you do still doing here? Yeah, let's get the fuck out of here. He won't be any happier if we stay around. So, yeah. This ain't looking good, Kelly. You know what to do, yeah? Posters, you can handle. But keep an eye for those cultists. They can be dangerous. Anything crops up, you call in a squad car. Yeah, I can manage. I know I can. 421 on duty. Have a good day, 421. Well, actually, they're starting to be much nicer now that they actually like me. And I like that. Instead of giving me smart Ale being smart Alex and giving me weird comments and shit. There, let's take this thing down. Ah, it's ripping up the place. So, no need for... Well, I need to do a favor for the Tatangrias. Kelly, got a moment? Depends. Got something for me? Yeah, nothing too big. I need to screen one of our men. Will, will you help me out? Sure. What can I do to help? It's about our man Alfonso. Thanks to you, we dug up some dirt on him. I suspect he's working with the Melazanas. Just the thought should earn him a bullet. But we want to be sure. We went 
want you to sweep his car. It's a black Cadillac. Crodillac. He lives at 605 and parks around there. He should be show up around 10 a.m. Deal. Anything else? You find anything, you bring it to me. It'll be waiting at... I'll be waiting at 4 p.m. staff. Okay. But here's his car, probably. What a pile of bullshit, man. So, check the plates. That's his car, I guess. Let's see, let's see what he said. Search the black Cadillac Cad 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 park at 6 of 5. Search the black Cadillac. Oh, it's right here. It's right here. So, how can I search it? Search car. I can't search the fucking car. Well, there's 25 minutes left. So, I'll just hang around here, I guess? Or what? Well, it wasn't his car then. Well, I'll just do this, ride a ticket, that's a parking, that's a paddling, that's a paddling. So, combat propaganda action, we're down propaganda posters, search by Cadillac at around 10 p.m. I have a little bit of time, I can waste. I saw his car. This is central. 421, cultist reporter preaching outside Matthias' workshop. Yep. It's around here then. Is this legal? Hey, you prophet, you get the fuck out of here. You know, he's leaving, so that's a prophet. Well, he's not doing anything right now. Kelly, got a moment? Not really. See what's happening around here. Been chasing those cultist whack jobs all day long. I need a favor. Remember our deal? Sure. Can we talk about it tomorrow? It's urgent. Uh, but it's things so hectic I guess I can wait. Come first thing in the morning. Yeah, sure, I can do that. I'll just wait for the Crodilac to show up here, I suppose. Uh, that's a parking violation. Should show up now. So let's uh, tow his car. All towing. And then we have it here. This is also a freaking ticket. The dude should be here any moment now. I hope, I really fucking hope that he shows up now. Seven to minus one, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, will he come now? It's 10 a.m. Is that his Crodillac? Is that it? No. But he's get this guy is getting a ticket though. Uh, also get towed. This then? Nope. But he gets a ticket too. Ah, uh, find a solution. Uh, you get the hell out of here before I arrest your ass. But I saw a black crawler like coming over here, so um, yeah, now he's here. What? Search the car. Let's see now. This is something that I'm not very good at. Yeah, he has something in there. I have to redo this, but yeah. I suck at this minigame. Oh, I have to wait too. Nobody here. The greaseball got his facts wrong, or I did the shitty sweep. I did a shitty sweep. Car theft at 605. Well, that's right here. Officer. On what grounds did he do that sweep? Ah, fuck. Jesus. I fucked up. Ah, oh, crap. I'm not good at that game. He had something there. I just didn't find it. Uh. 
God damn it. Sick fox. Yeah, they are a sick fox. Uh, Chase call to us uh, outside of 631. What's this? You should drop by the pawn shop. And you turned up. Right, give me a minute. Officer, we need you at the pawn shop. Some guy, a lieutenant, is go doing a sweep. We might just find something we didn't have time to clean up. We heard all of us. Ah, screw you guys. I don't care about the crew anymore. You there, get the hell out of here. He hid in here. There we go. Okay, I'm taking care of all the posters now, and let's go and see what Andrews. Am I late? Lieutenant Giddies, DEA. Officer Jack Kelly. That's right, ringing the bell. Oh, that's it, the diamond case. It's an ongoing investigation. I'm ro rooting for a positive outcome. Keep it up. Anything else, Jack? As you can probably tell, I got my hands full here. Gonna find something on these fences any minute now. Yeah, you can keep doing that. Chin up. Yeah, 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 yeah. Can you get done with that? Because I want to talk to them about Kelly. No, Kelly. Andrew! God damn it. <laughs> I can't remember the names here. This is Central. Remember Sesame? Sesame. Mrs. Arabella's dog. It's just been released from hospital. Doctors determined it was anaphylactic shock. <laughs> right, the dog. <laughs> ah. Yeah, I gotta survive until tomorrow. I forgot about the damn dog. Really, forgot about it. And that's the cop leaving. I'll go and eat some lunch, go back to the pawn shop, find out about Angie. And, well, everything should be nice and dandy after that. Because I've taken down all the fucking posters, I've chased away the, the priests, all the cultists, and all that stuff. So it should be fine. Another cultist gets your ass to 601. Ah, so far away. Chief, Angie's here. I'd rather talk to her in private. You gotta be kidding me. In that case, yeah, I am. Angie, can you tell me what's going on? I'm scared. They're gonna kill me, just like Lester. Who? I can only make guesses. So? Remember that break-in at the senator's house? Yeah, heard not to. Sorry, there's are two of them there. Kenneth, who you whacked, and Terence, my boo. If there were two, I'd have whacked two. This ain't funny. Terence split with some precious shit and jacked from the he jacked from the safe. Diamonds. Yeah, but they ain't all. What else? A videotape. Somebody's killing people over a videotape? That don't make no sense. That videotape was more valuable than the stones. This footage could bring the senator down. Got it? This might be what they look they're looking for. That would explain a lot. They want it back. And they figure we got it. We? Lester, Terence, me. Why you all why you of all people? Terence cause he jacked it. Me cause I'm in that movie. Oh. Lester, cause he was in on everything. Great. Where's the tape? Don't know. Terrence might have it. But he's gone fr fucked right off. Ah, trust me. We're gonna find the punk all right. Easy, easy. There's enough bodies on the street as it is. If the tape turns up, you let me know, alright? Or what? Or you might find yourselves way out of your depth on this. I'll sort it out. We'll see. We don't need to deal with pigs around here. Can't say I give two fucks about that. This ain't a game, alright? I'll see you in two days. Okay, so two days. I'll be at my friend's. 633 apartment 7. What about the diamonds? Who gives a shit about some stones? I bet Terrence already pawned them off to some fence. This ain't good. 
You gotta lay low. You're one all out and proud on the street. Put a little ticket book in that sad pop gun of yours. Yeah, yeah, and our dicks can't measure up to yours either. Okay, so we know much more now. And I need to go scare off some stupid... This is central. Heard you call at this church. My god, people. I got a call. I'm sorry, it's bad. It's very bad. What have happened? Who's that girl? What? Maddie. She's the daughter of one of our parishioners. She hasn't been seen to church in weeks. Can you tell me why you're crying? <laughs> he's gonna ki 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 he's gonna kill someone? Kill himself. Okay, that now we're getting somewhere. Holy Trinity, sweet Jesus! Let us pray. It's bad, very bad. Fuck, get your shit together, father. Oh yeah, Jack, you go. Who are you talking about, kid? Your daddy? Yeah, I heard him talking to Uncle. Uncle who? Uncle got something to do with it? Yeah, they kept talking about it. Okay. We're saying there were many friends waiting. Oh, and that they were ready t and they'd take me with them. Okay, so it's a suicide cult. Can I find them? Uncle lives above the drugstore. What's his name? Lewis. And where do you live? Can you tell me? 609, number 3. How about you say my daddy, he was already dressed, he might have left the house. Sweet Virgin Mary, Holy Trinity! Oh my god! So I need to go to 609, and Maddie's uncle lives above the drugstore. Here's Crank's drugstore. So I'll do it on the way, the... the, the Lewis, 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 there is a Lewis. Hello, anybody there? Damn, no one's answering. I'll keep looking. That was six, halfway there, yeah, yeah, no. Time flies, having fun, running like crazy around the streets. Uh, 609, number 3, I think it was. Let's see. Uh, 609, number 3. 609, number 3. Kane. McFly. I guess all of these are kind of like... Um, shit, someone's coming down. Looks like another of the other cultists. This might be... Little Maddie's father. I'll follow him. Well, I... Well, it's possible. Maddie was uh, bl black, but sure, I mean... And there's the, el the other one. Maddie wasn't lying. The meeting should be about to start. Then I'll find out where the fuck this meeting is at. I mean, it's not impossible that she might have a white father, so... But I guess this is just some <laughs> basic thing, because they are very obvious with that black thing around them. He went up there. That's the uncle. Going to, looks like they're going to the meeting. Let's see where they're going. Are they going to the laundry place? Then I'd get a little bit pissed. There's three of them. There's another one. What the hell are they? Where are they going? There's more of them. Where are they going? Yeah, I'm just asking the same question. Not bo donuts. Not the rental place. They're going into 633. All of them. Do, 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 do. Don't mind me, I'm just walking around here. Up, up. Well, the question is now, where did it go? There's something going on behind that door. Maybe I should wait. I see everyone here, then kneel down. We've been preparing for this moment for a while now. For a while now, I gave you everything, I gave you life. <laughs> now you get back what's most precious. Fuck, things are getting hot. Uh, I'll wait a little bit more. Take this from me, one each. I need to raise your hands and wait for a sign. Now, break down the door. 1013, this is 421. I need backup at 633. I'm coming in. Sounds of a breaking door. Badam!
Police, everybody get down! I said, down, damn it! You're under arrest! Everybody stay back! On backup is on the way. Backup arrives at the scene. Among the cheers of his followers, Reverend JJ is put in a police car. This is the end of the Church of the Third Revelation. It was a freaking suicide cult. But I just wanted him to, you know, give out the suicide pills and then we could continue. Why is he running around then? Mention a race? Nah, thought so. Let's see now. Do I still have to go to uh, 601? Yeah, I still have to go to 601. Oh, holy fuck. There's a lot of shit going on here. Well, I still need to go to 601 because there are still cultists there. They probably didn't get the memo that their glorious leader was taken down. And that's when the sound disappeared. Hey guys, I'm sorry to say that the sound cut out here while I was recording. And there's the sound why. Because I was downloading the, uh, the Secret World closed beta version. And for some reason, it started to fuck up with my recording, and it really annoyed me. But hey, I got to play the game at least, but it destroyed this one. So what I'm doing right now is that I'm just going to talk a little bit and try to explain what the hell I was doing. There's something odd here showing that um, the cultists, they have a black thing around them, as you, can, as you can see. Uh, I've tried to rip down all the propaganda posters. And it was really hard because, actually, this pixel art looks beautiful here, but also, at the same time, it's freaking hard sometimes to see where everything is. So I'm running around, running around, and not seeing anything. I'm starting to get the panic on here because I'm getting close to the end of the day. And right here by Crank's Drugstore is the freaking poster, and I can't see it. Right, I had to meet the guy by the hot dog stand and tell him that I fucked everything up. Yeah, I did a bad sweep of this car and it's mostly because I suck at doing the sweeps. I really do. I'm not very good at them. Uh, and also, I thought I would have more chances to try the sweep rather than just once. And uh, I lost something from the mafia. And because of that, fuck this car, I'm going to give it a ticket. I get fucked over, you get fucked over. It's that simple. So that's the hot dog. Yeah, I'm still trying to find the propaganda posters and it's still over by Crank's office. By the drugstore. Yeah, finally found it, at least. And that's all the posters. And I was really, really, like, horrified by it because it was so hard. I had just taken down the cult I've taken down everything in the morning, everything. People are panicking. I didn't even read what they said on the screen. <laughs> People are panicking about something. And there's a robbery. Ah, there it is. That's the last poster. Hopefully it's the last poster. There we go. And there's the perp too. And I'm out of stamina. Always out of stamina. Kelly has actually not that bad stamina considering that what his friends are and I've just caught my 20th thief I'm impressed by myself and we have a gratuitous visit by Officer Fatass I love that woman she's so I mean how could they hire that person isn't there like a standard like a health standard oh no I still have more posters isn't there like a health standard of how well in shape or out of shape an officer is allowed to be while working as a police officer or perhaps it wasn't in the 80s or wrong this is more like an uh how should i say how should i put it it's more like in a movie where you can have the fattest bastard around can be a police officer the fattest the laziest the stupidest the most incompetent person can be a police officer in an 80s movie So let's see now. Yeah, 421. I found the last posters. Uh, poster, and uh, with 30 minutes left of the day. Damn, I'm good. Well, <laughs> basically, I'm just lucky that I found it because I was basically blind. Because I was in a panic and everything kind of like melded into the background. Oh, there's another car. 
Fuck you, and whoop! You get a ticket! I can't remember what else I was supposed to do here. Yeah, the tow truck is on its way, and we should be done in just a few minutes. Yeah, there we go. That's it. That's the end of the day. Can't really do anything else now. I love how the, <laughs> how the, you know, like, sparks flying about whenever they tow a car. That's really bad. So, that's the end of the day. And let's see how well I did this time. Something happens. Right, I forgot. The game broke at this point. So I wouldn't be able to see... I, I, I can't see what happened afterwards because everything just fucked up. Well, anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. And if you like what you saw, do leave a like and a comment. I'm going to try and get back to where we were. And I'll see you guys then.